Corey, back to school. I hope, I'm, tell me the name of this school, because it looks like Macon to me. I want to make sure I'm getting that right, bud. Yeah, Mackin. Mackin. Mackin okay. School. Mackin you. Elementary. I had to ask myself, are you ready to see some kids who are revved up? All right, mountain lions, what sound does a mountain lion make? Oh, yeah. They are roaring it up, and good morning, you guys. We are here to show off some beautiful faces. Thank you all for getting up early. Oh, yeah. We're, we're showing off our new haircuts. Summer's coming, and I see Summer's some of them coming. are already getting to jump yeah. on it. Uh, Julie fine. Frost is with us. You're our principal, yes. and congratulations on 33 years in the Creighton School District. What was your first job here? My first job was uh, fifth grade. Uh -huh. I taught fifth grade and then moved up to reading specialist, uh, coaching, and then a uh, principal for the last well, six years. Step, step over here with me, and we'll let Tom continue to show off all these beautiful faces. Boy, oh boy. What what generally are the uh, boundaries of, of the Creighton District? Uh, the Let Creighton people know where we are. Yeah. We're right across from the Phoenix Children's Hospital. Mackin is on 22nd Street between uh, Thomas and McDowell Streets. Gotcha. So uh, yeah, pretty near the 51 there. Exactly. Wow, these kids are super enthusiastic. Thank you for all the Thank signs. You. Oh, yes, you're welcome. Well, our colors are purple and gold. We are the mountain lions. Yeah, I see we that. Have, uh, preschool through eighth grade here at this school. Gotcha. And we're seeing, uh, I think, up through about sixth grade today yes. or fifth? Yes, up through fifth grade today. Very good. Yeah. Well, you're the pride of Gunnison, Colorado. Yes. How does a girl get from Gunnison to Phoenix? Well, not by wagon train anymore. <laughs> um, after I graduated, I lived in Reno for a while, and then I moved back. I moved down here to be with a, a friend, and I've lived down here for 35 years now. Well, so. you're doing a great Thank job. You. you know they love you here. Uh, we've got lots more to show you. In fact, the next half of all of these mountain lions, they're up early, and they are glad to be on the tube. So more coming Locked your way, Celeste rocks. and Troy from love it. Mackin. School, home of the mountain line. See you in a few. Great posters. Yeah. Way to go, kids. Nice job, Mackin. Good job, kids. We'll go, see you in a bit. Well, Corey's gone back to school, and they don't just have kiddos that can do some pretty cool cartwheels, <laughs> but the teachers. It's fun seeing teachers doing cartwheels. What yeah, else you I got know. for us, Corey? Yeah, so noisy here, guys. We've got two of our best cartwheelers of all. This is Dylene, and this is Helena. And how old are you, Helena? Six. Six. So are you in first grade this year? Yes. Yes. And are you in kindergarten this year? Yeah, I'm five. Five is a pretty fun age to be. And you are some of our best cartwheelers. Can you show us one more each? Yeah. No, you go first. Watch the extension here. Oh, yeah. Very nice. And wow, just like a star. You're, you're Olympic material. Nice job, honey. Oh, gosh, she never stops. She almost took out my tooth. Well, we've got more mountain lions to show you, you guys. Oh, yeah, there we are. Wave it up, everybody, because we want to see all your big smiles. There we go. Now, you'll notice they're going to get taller as we head down the line because I think we're K through 8 here, but uh, we've got kids up through 6th grade this morning. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So we've got up through your sixth graders here. Is that right today? Yeah, today up through sixth grade. We also have seventh and eighth grade on our campus, and then also a preschool that has Wednesdays off. So oh, we're nice. preschool through eighth grade here. I would love a Wednesday yeah, off once in a while. That'd be a nice way to live, yeah. wouldn't it? Yeah. Sure. A little preschool. So home. you're just back from spring break. Yep. How do you push through to the end of the year? What's 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 the schedule like for these kids as they get going? Uh, all of our students are getting ready for AZ Merits which is in about two and a half weeks. And then we do uh, a lot of fourth quarter projects. Oh, fun. And we do uh, problem-based projects because we're a STEM school. Uh -huh. And so the students figure out what the problem is in the world and we help solve it. Golly, well, this is not like school was when I was in school. We were, uh, we were lucky to stagger through May without any stitches. That was usually our goal. Our goal. It's still our goal, <laughs> yeah. Well, thanks for sharing all these little ones with us, um, and thanks for uh, hosting us. We love this. And McCann is the school. The Mountain Lions are the mascot. I thought 
I thought they were the macaws, but the, they were not. The macaws, of yeah. course, as we know, the, macaws are the cool. talking the bird macaws. out of South America that is often introduced to the United States in someone's cargo shorts. But <laughs> uh, no, these are these are the mountain lions, and uh, they're happy to be up early. All right, you guys, enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for helping us out today, you mountain lions. Way to go, we'll mountain see lions. You soon. Uh, I got this purple and I yellow know. one. Those are good colors. And you know what? They take a lot of pride in those posters. They did a nice job. Yeah, they did a great job.